Welcome to a preview of exciting new features in Sigma 4. One of the major pain points identified in Sigma 311 is the challenge with workflow to allow the employee to make corrections and to know where a transaction is in the process of approval. Watch this short video to preview the improved functionality to allow employees to monitor, edit, and recall various transactions after submission. This functionality will be available through many transactions across the system. However, for this video, we'll showcase a timesheet, a leave request, and a travel expense report by way of example. Just as before, you can make changes to any transaction that is in draft status by clicking the edit button in the top right corner of the screen. However, for this demonstration, we're gonna focus on how to make changes for those transactions that have been submitted and are currently either pending manager approval or ones that have already been approved. You can check the status of your transaction by looking in the top next to the transaction name. In this case, you'll see pending written in blue next to timesheet time I. By clicking this blue pending status, you can now track the work in progress. This new feature will allow employees to check the status of their pending transactions within Sigma 4. Also next to the transaction name, you can find the nine dot menu. By clicking on the nine dot menu, you'll find additional options for each transaction, such as view attachments, add comment, additional transaction information, collaboration, and add digital signature. If a change needs to be made to a transaction that is pending manager approval, you can do so by clicking on the three dot menu to the right of the screen. Within this menu, you'll find an option called Recall from Workflow in the Primary Actions column. Click that. This example is shown using an employee leave request or an LREC. After clicking Recall from Workflow, you'll notice an informational message that appears in the blue box on top of the transaction. It reads, Recall Action Completed. The transaction is now back in draft status, and you can once again click the Edit button in the top right corner to make any necessary changes. Next, we're going to show how you can make changes to a transaction that is in final status or one that has already been approved by your supervisor. For this example, we're going to use a travel expense report or a TRER. In Sigma 4, this action will be called modifying a transaction. To do this, click the three dot menu and select modify from the primary actions column. The transaction will, once again, revert back to draft mode. In draft mode, click Edit to make changes before resubmitting. We hope you find these improvements will create a more efficient experience to allow you to both track work in progress and make necessary changes after submitting a transaction. For more information about the Sigma 4 upgrade, visit Sigma 4 Upgrade on SharePoint. To find the page, navigate to the State Budget Office site, then using the SBO Agency's dropdown, select Sigma. There, you'll find Sigma 4 Upgrade.